Hey, Jim. Good to see you, man. What's the trouble? Take a guess, bro. Might have something to do with those cops that pulled one over on us. I figured. The way I see it, we got two choices. Either we buy a big tub of grease and prepare to take it from these fat pigs the rest of our lives. Or... Or we head over to the clubhouse. Close to where I happen to know they got themselves set up, and we show them that we're not quite the bitches that they think we are. Well, well, tempted as I am by your first option, I'm gonna have to go with the second. I figured you'd say that. Lead on, James. Like the feel of a fully automatic pistol in your hand, you son of a bitch. How about we race over to those fucking dirty cops, old man? Think you can handle it? Feel that source, John. You ain't one this time. Yo, my bike. Go screw with your brothers, man. Where's the brother? Age before beauty, my man. Age before beauty. Wait here a minute. Hey, officers, how you doing? Hey, McCornish, this fat perps brought us a present. <laughs> oh, I forgot how stupid looking this guy was, Matthews. You think he's smart enough to realize that we got expensive tastes? What do you uh, got for us, Mo? Oh, exactly what you asked for. Well, all right. Oh. Oh. Hey! Oh. There you go! <laughs> Man. Head to Trinity and actor industrial, all right? The boys are gonna meet us there. You stole his donut and spilled his coffee. Balls is suck. You don't wanna piss him off, too. You know what? I can't wait to get him. Stupid pigs! It's nearly retirement time, fuckers! Balls! Don't let him catch you now, Jim. Shit for those dudes till God knows when. Now you know we ain't going out like that, Jim. I'll see you soon.
thought you might be interested. A race? Too fucking right. I'm in, man. I'll be there as soon as I can. Sounds good, brother. See you soon. Okay, let's race, man. <laughs> nice bat. Let's give these bitches some road rash.
the big bad biker man. Liz Torres, the meanest bitch in Bohan. Oh, come here, sweetie. Shit, I'd let you kiss me, but I'm afraid you'd stick a knife in my back while I was doing it. You wouldn't be the first man I tried that trick on, sweetie. Yeah, I heard the stories. Listen, I also heard you got somebody for that brown. Maybe. There's an apartment on Cassidy Street at Shortler. You go upstairs and talk to Charlie on the third floor. There any heat? When isn't there? I got a new guy going along with you. He's from Eastern Europe somewhere. If the heat's coming from Charlie, use this Slavic motherfucker to help. But if it's him, you know what you gotta do. Well, either way, it ain't coming back to you, Liz. Hey, you know Playboy? He's going along too. Hey, Playboy! Yo, chill for a second, show. Nah, not really. Well, don't you wanna dance? No, I'll just sit right here and wait for your boy. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> Surround yourself with cocaine and the asshole soon follow. <laughs> hey, Johnny! Yo! Come over here. Come here. Yeah. Nico, this is Johnny. Now, Johnny is sitting on a big pile of heroin. I don't go near this stuff, professionally. But I found him a buyer. We're nervous. Will you oversee the deal and check everything is cool? Sure. Thank you. Well, I gotta go pick up the stuff. So, uh, I'll see you there. Hi. Give me that shit, man. We got a buyer. I don't know why Billy got you to handle this, and not me. I mean, what's up with that, huh? I guess you Semites are good at... <laughs> sniffing out a deal. Uh, Isn't that right, Johnny? He didn't get you because Liz Torres and any other two-bit hustler on the street would take you for the little pussy that you are. And rob you blind. But give me that shit. See you around, big guy.
Buyer is some Asian dude called Charlie. Like in Vietnam. <laughs> Just like the movies, money. Yo. Hey, man. Hey, you ready? Sure, let's do this. Nothing like selling some dope to let you know you're alive. Let's go. Yeah, let's do this. All right, come on. Hey, what's going on, guys? What's going on? Not much. Let's do this. You got the heroin, right? Right? Come on, let's do this quickly. But you got the heroin, correct? You're carrying it, correct? I mean, it's a simple question. What's wrong with you? You're being fucking weird. <laughs> Not weird, man. I just want to know if you're carrying the stuff, right? You ain't right, friend. No, Come no, on, no, let's no. get out of here. LCPD! Freeze, motherfucker! I said freeze! Split up! You head for the roof! I'll go down! Fuck them all! I'll rip your heads off! is under observation by some kind of LCPD drugs task force. The buyer was a pig. Hell, Johnny, that's not kosher. I'll call you when another buyer's lined up. Sounds good. We're moving up in the world, Johnny. There's a congressman. Need your help. Tom Stubbs the third. I told you keeping that lawyer around would have its uses. This guy's at one of them dumbass gentlemen's clubs in Algonquin. The kind without tits. The jousters. Politicians and lawyers? What are we becoming, man? Next thing you're gonna tell me, we're doing some shit kicking for the LCPD. It's just opposite the Libertonian. Go pay him a visit. If you're still thinking about your brothers and not just your own ego, that is.
Johnny Clevis? Yeah, who's this? He tried to offload some smack to a colleague of mine called Charlie. Costly mistake. Who the fuck is this? Agent Jones, FIB. We'd like you to come in for a talk. Things might be easier for you if you give us some information on your motorcycle club. Fuck you, Fed. This conversation's over. If you got any evidence on me, get a warrant. Do you have an appointment? Uh, no. I thought I'd inquire about a membership. Excuse me? Uh, yeah. Under this ravaged, drug-addled exterior lies the heart of a reactionary prick, so I thought I'd fit right in here. I think you should leave, sir, before I call the police. I think you should leave, sir, before I... Dude, it is the 21st century. Let me tell you something. You've got a job wiping rich pricks' asses, and for some reason, you seem a little pleased with yourself. Will you leave? Trust me, man, nothing would please me more. But I'm supposed to see Tom Stubbs, and, well, he said to meet him here. Oh, Mr. Stubbs, sir. Okay, you only had to say so, sir. Follow me, will you? Mr. Stubbs is in the day spa, receiving some back work. Right you are. <clears throat> <laughs> <clears throat> Mr. Stubbs, a gentleman for you. Oh, thank you, Levis. And thank you. <laughs> uh. So, you're David Grossman's friend. Oh, yeah. We're old, old buddies. Love the old boy network. Yeah, I can imagine. So, what is it that you want? Could you excuse us, sugar? Okay, sure. And thank you. Best massage I ever had that didn't involve a happy ending or a poignant sense of guilt afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> See you tomorrow. Tom Stubbs, how do you do? Well, now that you mention it, I'm starting to feel a little queasy. Don't be pathetic. And no secrets here, pal. Now listen, I'm in a bit of a bother sport. Well, I think they could fix that with surgery these days, you know? Can we stop with the jokes? Grossman tells me you're reliable. Grossman? That guy's an asshole. Look, I'm not gonna insult your intelligence by pretending to be a good guy. I'm a politician. I'm a cynic. I'm very needy. I need people to like me. I need people to like me so that they elect me. I need people to elect me so that I feel marginally less bad about myself when I stare into the mirror. That being said, I try to do a good deed here and there. Democracy's a beautiful thing. Personally, I prefer a benign dictatorship without the pretense of choice. But let's leave the political discussion, shall we? Yes, let's. Unfortunately, an awful man has ensured that my chance of being reelected is pretty much zero. Why? Blackmail? Not exactly. I need his money, and he hasn't died. What? You want me to kill your father? No, that's disgusting. How could you suggest such a thing? My father died years ago, thank God. No, my uncle. That sanctimonious do-gooder controls the family trust. Whoa, that's heavy, man. Yes. So is being arrested for drug running and spending the next 30 years in prison. 
You and your little gang, I mean. I see. You make a wonderful politician. I know. Now, you've got to get the old goat today. Make it spectacular. Make it appear as though it's a terrorist act. That'll do wonders for my campaign in all sorts of ways. Uh, Levis will give you a package on the way out. Right. Oh, and Klebitz, trust me, I am what I am. But I look out for those who help me. A blackmailer with a conscience. Beautiful.
This town is locked up. Okay, Clevitz. Give me the good news. I'm just about happy with the eulogy my researchers drafted up. Sadly, Stubbs, I'm not going to be able to disappoint you. Your uncle is no longer with us. For my conscience's sake, I hope your lack of humanity is a genetic quality. Oh, uh, he was a man of the people, a philanthropist, a pompous windbag, and an occasional ketamite. Typical stuff, you might say. Sleep easy and drop into the club sometime soon. for you. Sorry. A handout ain't gonna fix it, Johnny boy. I'm into something bad. I need a knight in shining armor to take me away from this mess. They're gonna kill me. Or worse. Jesus, Ash. Where are you? Some project on Wardite. Come quick, baby. I'll try. We're all about conflict resolution in here, pal. See you through a shitstorm. Stay safe. Stay Second Amendment.
You want to see dirty? I'll show you dirty fool. <laughs> Baby! Baby, I'm here! You sure know how to get yourself into trouble, don't you, baby? You sure know how to get me out, Johnny. Come here. What's wrong? I don't want to hang out here. Can we go? I don't want to hang here, neither. Then again, I'm not the one messing up my head on a week-long ice binge. I remember when you used to mess around at my place. That don't happen anymore, either. Take me home, man. I'm crashing hard. You all right? I'm with you now, Johnny boy. How could I not be? How long you been up? Two days? Three? Who's... It ain't good for you. You know that. Sure, sure. Do you expect me to stay clean when you're not there to look after me? Maybe if you answered your calls. Fuck. Whatever. Okay. I'm bad, baby. I'm bad. I know it. You should teach me a lesson. Hit me or something. Teach me I'm wrong. Enough of that. Teach me, baby. It's the only way I'll learn. Make me hurt. You're making yourself hurt already, you fucking idiot. Hit me. Give me a break, sweetheart. I used to fucking love you. You're too sweet for words, Johnny boy. You think I'm sweet too? You ain't good for me, sugar. That's all I know.
smash his bike like this? Nice place you got here, sugar. Not now, honey. I ain't feeling so good. I thought you said you stopped smoking that stuff. I did, Johnny boy. I did. I promise. I never lied to you. Come on, baby. That's crap, and <laughs> you know it. I never lied to you when I was sober. Well, my whole life's falling to shit, sweetheart. I guess it was dumb of me to think this would be any different. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know I ain't much, but I'm all yours. You do know that, baby, don't you? If you say so. I love you, Johnny. Thanks for saving me again. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you know what? We're better than this. We can, we can live better than this. Yeah, well, let's hope so. Say the word, honey. Take that bike, we'll ride off into the sunset, you and me. You, <coughs> me, and that little habit of yours. You're my habit, Johnny. <coughs> and you are ridiculous. Feel free to browse, buddy, but don't try anything funny. Johnny, it's Jim. You wanna roll on some dead beats? What a fantastic idea, James. I'll see you at yours. Great, man. See you soon. James, how you doing? Getting through it, brother. Just about. Listen, that guy we stole those Angels of Death bikes for, he's got a whole shopping list of bikes he wants. You interested in procuring them for him? As long as it ain't gonna get us in the shit with any more dirty cops. Them cops ain't around no more. 
Get Angus on the wire when you're ready to roll. He's got the details. So long, brother.
Lost MC. Let's do it. Let's go find the dead beach, my friend. Cruising around on God. Let's go, boys. MC, let's do it. All right, man. We got to track down these dreadlock freaks. Who's around Bohan? Let's roll, boys. Oh, <laughs> 